you know, I talk about this every week with Terry Wolf, my Canadian guest, and he's he uh, he sees this the same way, and it's just kind of like it's part of that theory of I don't know if you if if you'd followed Donnie Darkens, who's got a big account mm -hmm. on, on yeah. Twitter, and he says, and it makes sense because we're sold this image that it's Diablo with horns, right? And the right. new world order. And that is the antichrist system. But you're like, well, wait a minute. The Bible says that it's going to be so deceptive that it's going to trick even like the, the Christians, like even like the hardcore, hardcore Christians. Mm -hmm. And it's like, well, then that means that the devil's not going to come with the horns and all that. Right. It's like, we'll, we'll see it from a mile away. So how are Christians and others, you know, discerning people going to be fooled? It's not going to be the Klaus Schwab New World Order. So I think, again, it goes back to with my Jeff Ny Nyquist thing or with Donnie Darkin, where I think he's on to something. His whole theory may not be exactly right, but he's he's something is there that he's talking about. And so he says that, you know, you've got um, the Great Reset versus the Great Awakening. Mm -hmm. And he says the Great Awakening is the false light. Right. And that, you know, maybe, you know, Trump comes back or whatever, and maybe QAnon turns out to be true. And he def he comes back and he pulls out of NATO and says no to Davos. And it's the Great Awakening. We're winning. We've defeated the NWO. And it's like, no, this is the real New World Order. Yeah. You know, this is the New World Order. And I, I think... That might play out again. I maybe it won't. Maybe Donnie Darkin will be wrong, but I feel like that makes more sense. If I were the devil, I'd do that. <laughs> no, 